Hello everyone, welcome to another SpaceX update video. With no launch date on the horizon for the next Starship flight, SpaceX has pulled a surprising move by dethroning Booster 9. They removed the hot staging ring from the top of Booster 9 for reasons we're yet to uncover. Speculation is rife, but it could be for gaining access to the top of the booster. Let's see what unfolds at the launch mount. Meanwhile, over at Massey's test site, Test Tank 26.1 underwent a cryogenic pressure test, and it pushed the boundaries until it popped. The primary goal of such tests is to gather extensive data by pushing the limits of the tank. Now, turning to Florida, the second segment of the crew access tower for Launch Complex 40 has been successfully moved to the pad. In case you missed it, SpaceX is upgrading Launch Complex 40 at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station. This upgrade will support both cargo and crew missions to the ISS, ensuring mission continuity for NASA and SpaceX in case of issues at Pad 39A. Before we end the video, let's visit the moon. Let's dive into the latest updates on the Chandrayaan-3 mission. The Indian moon lander has been in a deep slumber for nearly two weeks, and it's time to rouse it from its celestial nap. Ground control in Kourou, French Guiana, has been beaming signals to the Chandrayaan 3 lander, but it hasn't responded just yet. Now, this isn't cause for alarm, it often takes some time for the lander to establish a communication link with Earth. What could be the reasons behind the silence from the lander? Well, there are a few plausible explanations. It could still be in the process of booting up and initializing its systems. There's also the possibility of a glitch in its communication system. Alternatively, it might simply not have received ground control signals yet. Patience is key here, and we eagerly await more updates from ISRO as the mission progresses. That's all for this video. Thanks for tuning in, and be sure to stay subscribed for more exciting updates in the next video.